great song on the radio in Liberty City, but the idiot DJ doesn't tell you who it is? Find out the artist and name of any song on the radio using Zip, the remarkable new service. Call us. And we'll tell you what you're listening to based on a complicated listening system that also helps the government spy on you. Go. Just dial Zip 555-0100. And follow the instructions from our needy, washed-up celebrity. So simple, even a spotty teenager could do it. Zip, because we'll spot the record for you. The home of classic funk and Afrobeat. Oh, I have 99. <laughs> Aging? Science has the answer. Science has the answer. Freeze yourself today so you can experience the future. With Liberty City Cryogenics, you'll be placed in suspended animation using liquid nitrogen. Finally, science that makes you immortal. Start today and have your own cryogenics kit sent immediately. You can be frozen in time waiting for a better future before the weekend's out. We're taking the funk global right here on IF99. Remember where you guys stole? That's one 
first thing to worry about, moron. You have too many possessions, idiot. Keep the music down deep. I am Femi Kuti, bringing you some history. Fun, Afro beats. Chemistry. Electrolytes Extreme Sports Drink. If you don't replenish electrolytes as you work out, you could die. We analyze sweat scientifically with a microscope and gone deep into the electrolytic submolecular level. You need to replenish those electrolytes. What are electrolytes? Who cares? They're an extremely short supply, and we sell them. Look the part. Have trendy colored sweat just like in the adverts. Electrolytes Extreme Sports Drink comes in Arctic Douche, Icicle Fire, and Yellow Snow. Push your body to the extreme. Then drink it back to hell. Electrolytes Extreme Sports Drink. Sam and Nigel have long dominated the art world in Europe. Wow, an incredible career retrospective for lives at the Nuka. Back in the 1970s, they proved that flowers could be sexual by having sex with them. Then in 1987, they were wild enough with their coffee table art book called The Anorexic and the Gimp in Wonderland. And it's been non-stop incredulity ever since. Now these two middle-aged British homosexuals are photographing them 